TV Ants is a, a Windows program, but we're going to make it work on Linux. But basically, what TV Ants is is a um, P2P client that you can uh, share, uh, you know, TV channels with. So think of it like uh, LimeWire uh, meets TV channels, and um, you know, you're sharing with other people. So the more people you have, uh, I guess, the faster it will go because uh, you know more people are sharing. So that's what it is, and you're gonna need uh, Wine and VLC for this, or you can use M Player too. But uh, I'm gonna use VLC, okay? So after you have Wine, just double click on the, the e EXE and you install it. It's not gonna be a problem. Now after that, just open uh, TV Ants. All right. So this is the program, and um, and the first thing. Um, I would recommend is maybe adding more, uh, another server here okay so this is the the first one is the default server and I'll give you a list now I recommend adding this one also because it has more channels also okay so I'll just click on add down here and I'll show you what you th put in there so that's all you gotta put in there just this address <laughs> and that's it now you have two servers now when you go to the search here um, you see that they generated a list of all the channels. Now, if you want more, because now we have two servers with 118 channels, right? And you click on more, it should have more channels. Um, you see, there you go, two servers, uh, 217 now. And these are just, um, you know, the channels you can choose from. I don't really recommend using the the, the search feature because most of these are like in another language. But if you're searching for like ESPN or, or um, you know, soccer or something, then yeah, it will come up something like that. But like I said, most of these, look at this. Look at these characters. Um, I don't even know what the hell that is. Um, <clears throat> so the first thing you have to do is just scan through these and look at some channels you think you might like. <laughs> okay. So let me uh, look for some. I don't even know. Let's see here. Um... What is that? UK movies? What the fuck is this? UK movies, okay. We'll add that in and y'all do is click on selected. That's it. And you can click yes or no, it doesn't really matter because we're not even on the Windows. But basically, you have it over here. And uh, you see how it says the buffering? Make sure it has that. If it doesn't have that, you're not going to be able to connect it. And I guess the green part is the. Um, uh, you know your progress that that really matters that is buffering so this is kinda like um, you know LimeWire where you have peers and all that um, so how would you connect to this uh, you have to use a VLC or a, a player of your choice like M player or whatever and what you have to do uh, the easiest way I would say is um, click on that and um, click where it says open alright because this one will show you the the link that you have to connect to uh, t you can type that exactly like that like so in here let me see copy from clipboard and just type that into uh, here there's many ways to do this but um, you can type it like this MMS uh, localhost you know the same thing and that thing is 19 okay so you can type it like this 19 or add the ASF in if you like uh, same thing goes for if you want to type in um, HTTP I'm just gonna do it this way since you know it's already here and uh, you're not gonna be confused so you can type exactly like that um, most of the times it, it, all you gotta do is change the numbers because um, it goes in order like one two three four five six seven eight nine ten it goes in order like that so if I um, connect to it now it should work because uh, we have the buffering and now we just connecting it uh, locally and you see it's working uh, in a minute it's buffering here and there you go you have the the UK channel what the hell is this shit <laughs> But, um, and it does have sound and everything, you know, depends on the channels too. And, and there you go, that's how you would watch uh, this stuff. Um, 
keep this open okay don't close this if you close this uh, this will not buffer anymore and it will, it will die off so you can minimize this or whatever you want to do but don't end this process uh, of this program uh, so that's all I gotta say on that and um, oh yeah as far as for adding the thing in I, I what I did was um, open location from clipboard and I just edit it or there's another way to do this I believe there's an open stream in here and then you can type it in here too if you like you know like uh, HTTP or MMS which is exactly what we did before and it, you know just um, the same crap same thing here and that's how you connect to um, with it with the VLC so that is it and um, oh yeah let me show you um, the download page it's uh, pretty weird you have to go to their site here because uh, if you down some, any other place it ain't gonna work okay so go to their site uh, tvans.com download this link or um, make sure the files like about two to three megabytes uh, I think it was 2.3 or something like that but uh, it has to be two two megabytes or higher because if you try to download some other ones it's kind of like in um, like 300 KB and that's not the one that you want you want the one that's in uh, uh, megabytes okay so that's the one that I download from this one the alternative link and install that with wine and it should work and that's how you get uh, all these channels okay uh, you can watch sports you know oh they have some porn channel that I saw last time let me show you uh, this is the one the maximum I think it was like the playboy channel or something so yeah go and, and get that too <laughs> that's it